Hi, in this video, we're going to go over two functions of the 7510 to help you weigh animals. The issue with animal weighing is that they move around a lot and the numbers move very fast and do not stay stable because the animal is not uh, at rest. So there's two different functions that we can change on the 7510 to help us see numbers. The first one would be to do digital filtering. Digital filtering slows down the numbers, allowing you to see them go up and go down slower. So right now you see it instantly goes back to zero when I press and let go of the scale. So we can change that filter to make that go slower. So to change that, you're gonna to go into the settings. You're gonna press hold and print. And we're gonna change this to C28. So we're gonna go left, we're gonna go up two times to two, and then go back here, and then we're gonna go down to eight. So C28, and we're gonna change print. So there's different strengths for the filtering. It goes all the way up to six. So we can put it to six and I can show you what it looks like at the highest filter, filtering rate. So we're gonna press print to save that and then ACCM to exit and out. So right now, if I press on the scale and I let go, it takes a couple seconds to get all the way back to zero, whereas before it would instantly go back to zero. Okay, so with animals, you know, this can be very helpful. You can see the, the numbers a lot easier and they'll move around a lot less when you have an animal, you know, that is uneasy. Another function of the 7510 that you can use would be the, the average hold function. What takes a sample size of three seconds of weight and it will give you the average of that weight. So to do that, you're gonna press hold and print again and you're gonna go to C11. You're gonna go here, change that to one, C11. So average hold function on the indicator would be four. So we're gonna change that to four and you're gonna press print and then ACC1 to exit. So say you have an animal here, it keeps on moving around. You're gonna press hold and you'll see LOC. And it, right now it's taking that three second sample and the average was 12 pounds for those three seconds with the animal on there. So again, to clear it, you'll just press hold again and then you can do the next animal. So we'll do it again. and 16.2. So this is especially useful when, again, weighing animals that are uneasy, just don't like being, say, in a chute or on a scale, and you need to weigh them. If you do have any questions, if you need any further assistance helping you fix this on your indicator, or if you're looking to purchase an indicator from us or any other scale, please give us a call or check out our website, celatonscales.com.